Let me explain to you guys our bill, okay? We have uh, right now 25 AC, okay? And when we attack, we can get 29 AC by using defensive flourish. And since we are paladin, we can also smite. And since we are bard, we can smite with a lot of spell slots. And not only that, now that we got this ring and this helmet, this helmet uh, gives us arcane acuity. We will gain arcane acuity when we attack, which makes our spells stronger. And then, since we used an attack to make our spells stronger, we can now use a spell as a bonus action. I can attack with Flourish, get 29 AC, or even hit, use some of the other Flourishes. And then we can go to the battlefield and bonus action Hypnotic Patterns. And then they can't attack us. You know, I will not say your name because the last time I said somebody's name in chat, like, I remember my first month of streamer, somebody came to me, Lua, it's my friends. Uh, his name is Mike Hawk. Can you sing me happy birthday? My cock, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. I was actually a, a, a very wholesome, innocent young woman. But then the internet changed me. I realized that you guys were such pieces of shit, so I didn't need to be so nice all the time. <laughs> we'll attack her with defensive flourish, because then we have more AC. And then we'll crit smite her, level 4. We have 38 AC and yet she still hit us. I say we directly smite. And we crit. How about that? We have one more attack. I don't think a haste potion would help us here. Because a haste potion on honor mode only gives you one as for attack and I can attack with my bonus action. Pray! Level 3? Oh, She's at 5 HP. Oh, she killed Lazo! Can we have some Fs in chat for Lazo? And also for Orin. High five, let's go! You guys... I have been planning uh, and thinking about that fight for a few days. This is the hardest, one of the hardest fights. And this fight is the reason why, for my solo owner mode, I started this Dark Urge. Because then I wouldn't have to deal with the Kutas. I would deal with Orin. So I actually have been planning for this fight before we created Mantar. I have been obsessing and thinking this through for a while. <laughs> We're barding. You see? Just the fact that you are a bard, you already have an advantage in a row. When you're a bard, you're just unfailable. You're just so fuckable that even the dice wants to sleep with you. And then when you roll, your rows are just better. Okay, so we'll do everything the same. We'll start as Paladin, Oath of Vengeance. This is our attributes. Fighting style will go with defense because then we get one extra. Multi class into fighter now. We'll go for archery. Then level two fighter we get axe and surge. And then we multi class again into bard. Instead of deception, we'll take slate of hand. Our level three bard. We are going to go college of swords. And then we'll go dueling fight style. I don't think we need the intimidation, right? Because mind flare already gives us. I think perception. We'll get a savage attacker. Savage attacker because then whenever we hit our damage roll, we roll twice. Like this, we still have one paladin spell, level 4 spell, and we also have action surge. And our bow is better. I owe you no explanation. None. You're looking at my private things. And you are ask asking for an explanation of why I keep my favorite NPCs in my chest if they die. It's none of your business. You really... Psst. These books are sensitive. Is that true, books? Are you sensitive? So here's the plan. We do this.
I think they are surprised. Those rats, I think they will die when they hit us. Because I curse them with straight stage fright, which means that whenever they miss me, they take 2 DC psych. Except I brought with me this dumb rock that makes them take double that. Glyph a fire. You rats are fired. It's okay. I could use a wall of fire right here. Oh, but I really wanted to see the rats hit me and die. I can't risk my run on a fight with rats. Imagine if we survive Merkel and die to fucking rats. It would be pathetic. Let's see what happens to these rats. I really wanted them to attack me and kill me. Oh! Wait, why did that one not die? Down bad rat? K5. The next room. Wait, I'm overcumbered? Oh my god. That's so stupid. I'm telling people. Imagine the hag in a hag cauldron. And, and like, it's like muddy green. And then you can see like some things floating in the water, like some, a thumb, an eye. And then the, 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 the mossy water is covering like only the parts of the hag that matters. And then the hag is just like laying on the tub and she winks at you. And, and she goes like, Auntie Atto will need some help drying her back. Battle! Take off your clothes. What? Okay, let me remove my clothes. Ugh. A little misdirection. <gasps> Couldn't resist. Come here. She's so wet. <laughs> she made an entire lake? Damn, Mentar. <laughs> Just a pebble. Now don't you dare stop. That was cute! Okay, that was my first time seeing Shadowheart. Do you have another Sayina? Or is everyone who dated Shadowheart blue bald? <gasps> Take me and know the essence of the hell. For one depraved night, you feast on the sins of the body, the mind, and the soul. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, everybody! Let's go! Happy holidays! Woohoo! Is this what they mean by jingle bells? A pity for you. The one taste is all I'll oh. give. Oh, mommy, is or Kind of you to offer a free <gasps> show, then. Now that he's tried out inferior goods, he'll know just how good he has it already. Ah! Well, look who's snuck in from the shadows. Oh! Pleasant evening, I trust. I tidied up my hair and had an early night, but you don't look like you had much sleep at all. You, this is Boo. And Boo, meet you? I got this hamster plushie. To be made in the exact same colors as Boo. And I don't know if you realize, but I have a rabbit. This rabbit right here. And his name is Boo. Except my rabbit is a distant cousin of this Boo. Mine is a giant miniature space rabbit. That one is a giant miniature space hamster. They're distant cousins, but they're both... Just as epic. It is an honor. No, it is a hamster. <laughs> so all I need to know is, does that include you? Or not? I hate this woman. I think she's, she has this, this air 
that is just like so... She's just like snob, condescending, yeah. She's just like, ugh. Wicks, Her ego and a time is a lot larger sense. than... This was the latter. She acts first. You see, this is a troll barbarian build. This is one of my favorite builds. It's what N Nine Finger is using. Troll barbarian build is also one of the strongest builds early in the game. And you just get to throw shit. And you can throw as a bonus action. So, so even in the beginning of the game, you, you can throw like twice per turn. When I played with two troll barbarians, I, will, I stand in the top of the stairs, and then whenever the enemy would climb up, I would pick them up and throw them down, down the stairs. It's just like so funny. There is a few very strong people. You see this guy here? He's extremely strong. I think we should go kill Roa. Just because she has a, bi a resting bitch face. Let's use a defensive flourish. You know what? Fuck this. 47. This is fine. Many targets. Okay, so... Whenever you shoot a many targets arrow, it will bounce. And each time it bounces, it does half damage. So it's better if we do full damage to this woman. And he bounces for half on her because... Oh, this is so good. Hang in there! You see this dangerous guy? This dangerous woman? We can stop everyone who is dangerous. So, everyone who is dangerous... I can... There is three dangerous targets in this party. Wait... It's only 90%. Do we take the risk? I say we take the risk. 85... 81... And 90. Oh, shit. Two of them resisted. Oh, look at that. That's nine. Oh, I made this NPC's day. Look at that NPC. You're welcome. My favorite race in romance. Honestly, I don't have a favorite race. If you want to play the best and most broken race in the game, you have to play as a halfling. Because halflings start with the lucky feet. If I was trying really hard in this run, I would be a halfling. Halfling is by far the best race. Or at least an ogre. But Man Tower is just too hot. And I feel like most importantly, we really wanted to be very hot in this playthrough. Ooh. 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 Didn't I tell you guys that this guy was dangerous? Didn't I tell you? Ooh. This woman is so dangerous. Oh my god. I think this woman is dead. I think I'll go kill this paladin. So we can do a defensive flourish on him. And then we can do... I love a tree smite? Yeah, sure. Okay. 29. Oh, this is bad. I don't think I will use this might. Instead, I'm going to take action surge. And I'll just hit him again. Okay, who was the other scary boy? This guy. We're gonna do a slashing flourish on him. And we're gonna actually hit him twice. That was not enough damage. But we can uh, tell him to sit down. We can tell three people to sit down. Just for fun. You sit down. You lick the floor. Please lick the... Oh, it's out of sight? Okay, well, that's better. Because then we do the same, but we do a level 2. Lick the floor. You also lick the floor. Okay. How that? Yeah, you see, they would just lick the floor and not be able to do anything. I don't... I think the only woman from that, their team that will whack... Is this woman and this lady. Well, that lady will not be acting anymore. And maybe... Oh... I, I usually hate when in fights like this NPCs die. Like, friendly NPCs die. Oh, look at that. She's... She's 
glorious. Isn't this woman so beautiful? Jesus. We can just attack. I think he would die. Yeah. Mentar, stop looking at Nine Fingers boobs and focus on the fight. Nice. Pretty good. High five. I think this is the most beautiful lady in Baldur's Gate. I suppose I should have seen that coming. Especially when she's Zensory covered in blood. Known for their loyalty, but I thought the... You wanna see something funny? Free for the taking. So during that fight, she threw four of them. And this is why I think this woman is so hot. I just can't help but find this hot. Its breathing quickens as you pull in close to its face. Its excitement palpable. Okay. I can make this easier for you if you'd like. My other form might be more familiar for you to navigate. Mentor on Mentor? with your companions did you guys like to watch i said i'd protect okay you guys can i ask you guys a favor i don't know if larian has data on where the most screenshots were pressed okay but if they do you take some screenshots here just because if they do gather data like that imagine how fun it would be that this would be the most screenshotted moment in the game this looks especially nice if you're playing a shadow heart. If you're playing a shadow heart, this scene is iconic. Oh my gosh, so sexy. Look at this gaze. Muster the f might of your physical form. Mwah, mwah. Mentor starts kissing his his biceps. Come on, Mentor. Let's go! High five! I mean, Mantar is strong. Oh gosh. If I misclick on four, we just lose a run here. No, no, I will pick number one just because it's very far from from four. Oh my god. What the hell? These stars are aligning! High five, let's go! I believe in Mantar! If anyone can do it, it's him! You are delusional. The crown is how we controlled you. I hate Gortash. Has no respect for Mentor. You have played your part. The next order to be given is mine. And it is this. Die. Can we have some Ashley chat? The brain could only cast that spell once, hopefully. We will dominate the brain because we are Mentara. Let's go. It's okay. It's okay. Mentara pissed his pants a little bit, but but he's gonna be fine. Oh frick! Now you will witness the grand design. Are you single? Dominate the fucking brain! Okay, you guys. If we roll a 20, the brain, I think, has a little bit less of HP. Okay. Do we use our tricks? Please praise the bunny! Okay. We gave an offering to the bunny. We kiss the bunny. Okay. Now. Wish me luck. Oh, it worked. Holy fuck. I 
did like six playthroughs of this game. I never rolled a 20 here. This is my first time ever. Oh, horsing around works. I think the bunny gods are happy with us. Look, look, he's content. He rests. I've never seen this before. Holy shit! Oh! Sent by Mind Flayer can save us! A vibe! Do we evolve Mentara? Do you think Mentara? Becoming Tentara? Good one. Oh shit, do we want this? It's gonna fuck our attributes, but we should be fine. Make me a Mind Flayer! <laughs> We will do like we did with our Gloom Stalker. We'll go in, we'll cross the battlefield, and then we'll go. Okay. We'll move right here. And then we crouch. And then we go and turn base. The Emperor to this corner, and he's gonna crouch and be very stealthy. I think we can start channeling now. And then we'll pass one turn, and then we'll get in combat. We channel. Good. Now we pass. Now, to enter in combat, let's use Mind Blast. Shifted. Okay. Its will is weakening. Hold on. We'll fly inside. The brain is surprised. And he lost health because of our 20 court row. Let's use a defensive flourish. And we s we'll crit with luck. And then we smite as hard as we can. And then another defensive flourish. And then we will execute. And then we will use our highest might. Nice. We have action surge. Let's use a haste spore grenade. Let's put this grenade right here in front of us. Ice lashing flourish. Because then we will cleave the grenade and we will cleave the brain. And hopefully we will get hasted. We hasted the brain too, but that's okay. We'll just smite. A defensive flourish. Another day, another fight. Another smite. I don't know if we can kill. Oh shit! We hit a one! Okay, so we can re-roll. Let's use a level 3 smite. It's okay. Let's walk out of the haste spores. The Emperor can just pass. The brain's up. Oh! Now comes the danger. Oh shit! It was surprised! It didn't get invulnerable! Do you guys wanna throw my family? Nah! You know what? We earned this! We earned this! Let's just smite this brain ass bitch! What? Sure, let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Solo! Honor mode! No barrelancy! Nada! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Let's go! Oh, you guys are in trouble sleeping because of these! Oh! Kill it! High five! High feet! High, high five again! High feet again! High feet! High five! Let's go! Destroy yourself! And your death falls! Fuck your brain! Let's go! I think I got some new white hair in my head during this this run. I can't believe we did this solo owner mode. 
Oh my fucking god! For once the dice wasn't there to fuck me in the ass! Hugs! Oh. Hugs! Everything Hugs. you did, everything you sacrificed. I sacrificed so much sleep. It. So strong or cool. I will embrace my illitedness. I'm illited, I'm sexy, and I know it. I'll brush my chest here good. for you guys. To all of you, my real family. A cheer. Thank you for sharing you. this journey with me. Thank you, I hope you guys had fun. And hopefully we will start a new journey soon. To us! To the bunny! Thank you!